Lock browser allows you to browse internet or any website straight from the lock screen without entering your passcode. So you can see here if I swipe from the right, you get this page where you can browse a website. So here for example YouTube and you can go to any website here, you're gonna search or type google.com here, wait for it until it loads and you will get this page. And you can change anything within the settings of the tweak here. Lock browser, you get enable, enable switch and also to change between dark mode or light mode. And change the home page of the browser, so I set it to Google as a default. And you can also customize the view of the browser. And see text color customize the colors within the notification center. So you can see here each section has a different color. So you can see it from the header you have the pur purple color. And also here in this tab you have the red color and the text in yellow. Same as the notifications here you get different colors. And you can customize the colors in the settings of the tweak here. So you can change the color of the header text, the t date header, and also the text in the notifications tab. And you must press bring in order to t for the change to take effect. Smart volume control gives uh, volume HUD a new look. So you either have it under the status bar here. And what I really like is that you can control it by swiping your finger in the bar as you can see or you can have it as a small label with the percentage as you can see and you can customize the position and uh, the font color from the settings of the tweak round switcher allows you to round the app switcher cards to have them look like this and also you can customize the radius by going to the settings here so if you set the value up you will get less rounded and if I turn it, turn it down we will get like a rounded app switcher so we're gonna like increase the, the adjustment here and we're gonna spring and see the changes so you can see here the the cards are way more rounded and it's quite noticeable and you can have them sharp by turn this all the way down and also here you can have like an action when you swipe up the home card so we're gonna spring here and you can see and you can see like the edges are now sharper and if I swipe up the home card the phone will be resprung as you can see rift board allows you to access home screen applications within an app an app so you can see here in the settings so if I double tap on the home button you can see it's springboard from the application itself and you can access another application as you can see so go to the settings of the tweak here and and set an activator action so I already set one which is double press on the home button and you can choose here like the look of the home screen within application so you can see here I have no blur if I set it to light blur you will get a blur behind the icons and the dark blur as well and you can also allow rotation within app that's been it for this video guys I hope you enjoyed it and if you're not subscribing, make sure to do so for new content. Thank you for watching. I will talk to you in the next one.